Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to the Great Shield Investing Channel. My name is Akin Fomar, and as always, I'm excited to be here with you tonight. Fellas, this is the time for you to get out of your chair, get out of your couch. This is juicy time, and it's spicy time at the same time. What am I talking about? Guys, if you've been watching, I've been looking closely at the stock market, and you know, at the same time, you've been watching and you've been looking at the cryptocurrency market. It's been so juicy in the last 24 to 48 hours. So what am I talking about? Let's get into it. So fellas, you know, I'm always um, uh, uh, a big uh, fan of cryptocurrency. And the reason being the underlying technology, the blockchain technology for cryptocurrencies. So let's, let me just show you something real cool here that has made my day so juicy. This is Coin Paprika, guys. Look at what we have. This is 4.30, April 30th, and this is about 12.47 a.m. in the morning. Morning of the last day in April. I'm gonna refresh these guys before I go ahead to show you why I've been so juicy and this day has been spicy for me at the same time. You can hear it from the way I talk. Look at Bitcoin, fellas. Bitcoin is above $9,000. Can you believe that? The one hour percent increase is about 1.07% in terms of rising and increasing in price value in the last 24 hours just 24 hours guys the, my last video was over 48 hours ago and bitcoin right here was just hovering around 8,000 8,100 8,200 and within the last 24 hours bitcoin has risen so high above 9,000. This is 9,207.65 cents. So that means in the last 24 hours, Bitcoin has gone up as 18.1%. And look at the spicy side of it. It's so spicy, guys. Seven days ago, Bitcoin was down. And in the last seven days up to this moment, Bitcoin has risen and has gained 28.66% in profit and in increase and in value so guys if you had invested about seven days ago when bitcoin was around under seven thousand uh, dollars i mean under eight thousand dollars about 75 76 hundred you would have made about almost 30 percent of uh profit in them just seven days ago it gets more spicy as we go down we all know bitcoin is the number one cryptocurrency in the world. Bitcoin was the first and it's the first mover. And after Bitcoin, we've had a lot of altcoins that was developed after Bitcoin. We have Ethereum. Ethereum, as of yesterday, was trading under $200. It was like $195 and $196. In the last 24 hours, Ethereum has gone up 13.57%. In the last seven days, Ethereum, just seven days ago, Ethereum has pro produced 22.35%. XRP, XRP. This is my favorite right here. You all know I'm an evangelist for XRP. XRP as of yesterday was trading around 19 cents for one XRP. And in the last 24 hours, XRP has gone up about 9.13%. Seven days, 23.82%. And guys, just like my last video that I dropped like yesterday, I'm a big fan of Bitcoin, Ethereum, and XRP. These three, I'm invested in all of them. And I have about 10 odd coins that I'm invested in as well. So apart from Bitcoin, I have like nine to 10 other ones that I'm invested in. And in another video, I'm going to tell you, I have Binance. I have a couple of all these, but most of my bags is between number one to 20 in the, uh, on, the, uh, crypt, uh, on the cryptocurrency list. Between one and 20 
is what I'm invested in. There are some other altcoins here on the list that are good. Digibyte is another good one. Look at Digibyte. In the last seven days, Digibyte has gone up 71.19%. What are you talking about, guys? This is spicy and juicy time. I'm excited. <laughs> guys, this is what I've been telling you in the last few days. This is, this is a moment for you in time that you have to take advantage of this uh, problem we're all going through. There is a pandemic going on in the world, but there are things happening behind the scenes. It's a strange time as well. My last video was strange time and the secrets behind the strange things that is going on right now. So just like I'm, as I'm spicy and I'm juicy about the cryptocurrency market, I'm also spiced and excited for the stock market as well. So I'm gonna show you a few things in the stock market as well. So enough of uh, cryptocurrency uh, right now, let's shift over to the stock market. Stock market today was all green. Dow Jones was up, S&P 500 was up, NASDAQ was up. Guys, I'm just gonna um, show you a few things. I'm not really gonna log in into my account today, but a few things that I'm just gonna mention today I have a few stocks that I called out just a few days ago, or let's say a couple of two to three weeks ago. We all know what has been going on with uh, the effect of the pandemic affecting airlines and our cruise line. Those sector has been hit so negatively to the extent that they came down significantly. So American Airlines, the stock came down as as low as nine dollars and nine cent on April April the third. As of today, uh, April 29th, American Airlines was trading around twelve dollars sixty three cents. So you can imagine if you had invested at the beginning of April, you bought American Airlines when it came down to an all time low of nine dollars, and as of today, it was trading at twelve dollars sixty three cents. That's a good uh, percentage increase for you right there. Delta Airline came down uh, sometime in March to $19. As of today, Delta Airline was trading at 27 cents. The same thing with uh, Carnival Cruise. Carnival Cruise came down at the beginning of this month, April the 2nd, to about $7.80. Can you believe? As of today, 429, it's not even up to a month. Carnival Cruise has doubled. So if you had invested seven, uh, if you had invested when the stock came down to $7.80, today the stock was trading at $16.69. So it's way more than doubled. And then the most exciting one, Grayscale, GBTC, which has a correlation with uh, cryptocurrency. So GBTC is more of uh, uh, the grayscale company, um, but they are heavily invested in Bitcoin for those that cannot invest directly in Bitcoin and Ethereum and XRP. So they have a trust, the GBT, T, GBTC, grayscale uh, Bitcoin trust, whereby you can invest in the stock market directly into a grayscale and they will invest the money for you in Bitcoin. So Grayscale at, at, uh, as of March was trading around $5 and one cent. As of today, Grayscale was almost $10. That's almost double your money. So if you had put $1,000 at the beginning of March, today, 429, you would have made double of your money. And I tell you guys, tomorrow, I mean today, right now, today is 430, which is the last day of April. Grayscale is gonna go over $10. I can assure you that because Bitcoin is performing. Let's see right here. Bitcoin is performing at nine, so greatly in the last 24 hours, Bitcoin has gone 18%. So be assured that when the stock market opens tomorrow, GBTC will probably go up like 10 to 15% increase. So which is gonna take GBTC over $10. I bought a couple of GBTC when it was like six six dollars, 
and six six dollars under seven dollars almost what i have in gbtc was under seven dollars and as of today it was trading at nine dollars and 95 cent just just a little bit shy of ten dollars and then the last stock uh symbol that i'm going to share with you is macy's we all know that this pandemic affected a lot of retail stores macy's came down as at the beginning of april for two uh April 2nd, 4-2. Macy's came down to as low as $4.38. But as of today, 4.29, Macy's is trading at uh, $6.50. So be assured that in the next couple of months, Macy's is still going to go back up. But I will just assure you guys, be very careful before you invest your money. Do your own due diligence. Research some of these companies because we know what we're going through right now is not going to um, it's not just going to go away just like that. The effect that this pandemic has left in the stock market and, and with our lifestyle and a lot of businesses is going to be around for a while. So businesses are still going to suffer. They're still going to be struggling for a while, you know, so some of these retail stores might still come down. So be very careful before you invest your money. Macy's is going up right now, but I, I see, or I, I perceive that, Macy's will probably come down a little bit in the future and there will be more opportunity for you to reinvest or invest your money for the first time in Macy's and some of, some of all like AMC as well and entertainment. Uh, you know, we've not been able to go out and associate or have uh, uh, most of the fun that we used to have due to the social distancing order. So AMC is more an entertainment company that have a lot of uh, movie theaters. Uh, their stock has suffered as well as a lot of uh, airlines and entertainment industries they've been suffering. So AMC came down so much to about $1.95. And as of today, AMC is trading at $5. So if you had invested, you, you've almost tripled your money in AMC. But I believe they're still gonna come down. They're gonna pull back. Most of the, what, what's going on in the stock market today, they're moving up, but I believe they're going to come down uh, in the month of June, July, and there'll be more opportunity for, for you to reinvest if you missed out uh, investing in March or early April. So guys, I'm so, so psyched. I'm so, you know, you know, juicy right now. This is an exciting time. Fellas, I'm happy and I'm excited because I took advantage of when the market was down, when the cryptocurrency market was down. And most of, some of these things are still down compared to their all time high. They are relatively low. So you can still take advantage of them, but I'm not advising you to do that right now. Just do your own due diligence, research some of these companies, you know, compare their all time high to their all time low. See what's going on, see where they are right now. But um, I believe there is so much uh, on the upside down the downside. So guys, it's an exciting time. It's juicy time. It's a strange time. Take advantage of what's going on right now. Guys, one more thing. Uh, I'll show you this article before I wrap up this video. This is one article about GBTC Grayscale. And I'm really excited because I bought GBTC and I'm, I'm pumped up right now. You know, so why Grayscale Bitcoin Trust surged today? And this was April 29. Uh, just like I said earlier, Bitcoin price appears to be rallying ahead of the halving. So the halving will, uh, will cut the popular cryptocurrency's money rewards in half in the process designed to slow the rate of new Bitcoin creation until its maximum supply is reached. Only the, about 21 million Bitcoins will ever be created. That is one unique thing about Bitcoin. And I just don't know why people don't see, you know, this as an opportunity. It's it's a scarce commodity. It's a scarce thing. It's going to be scarce because you can only have 21 million Bitcoins ever. And when the happening happens, it reduces the hash rates. You know, the incentive that miners get. So it makes Bitcoin more scarce, you know. So the happening should help to highlight Bitcoin's attractive supply dynamics. 
at a time when governments around the world are printing their fiat currency, like all these paper currencies, at an unprecedented rate. They haven't expected to take a place in the month of March. We are going into uh, in the month of May, rather. That we're you know going into May. So guys, this is an exciting time, and we can see the movement of Bitcoin. Bitcoin is rallying so high right now. But look at it right now. Let me refresh this again. Yeah, I'm just so excited. Yeah. And guys, if you're invested in, in, in cryptocurrency, do not forget to keep your cryptocurrency safe. Be very, very uh, careful with where you store your cryptocurrency. I do not advise you to leave your cryptocurrency on exchanges. It's always good to have a cold storage, just like um, some of the cold storages out there. Um, we have the Ledger Nano. Uh, Ledger Nano S and Ledger Nano X. Those are cold storages where you can save some of your cryptocurrencies. I, I have uh, the Ledger Nano S. So guys, take advantage of that. Look at that. Bitcoin, the last 24 hours is above 16, you know, 16.9%, you know, in increase. So guys, I'm excited. Uh, in the next video, I'm just going to share with you why I think uh, the cryptocurrency is going to create a lot of millionaires and billionaires in the future. And if you're very, uh, if you're very uh, careful with how you invest your money and you have your exit strategy along the way, you know, I believe you're going to do really good in the cryptocurrency market. The stock market, you have to be very careful with that. Yeah. You have to know when to buy and when to get out and when to buy and hold. But I believe a lot of opportunity in the stock market is for you to buy between now and like, uh, I'll say between now and September, there'll be great opportunities in the stock market for you to buy and hold. You know, just buy and hold and live till like 2021, 2022, because I believe this year, stock market is gonna suffer a lot. We can see the pump right now in the stock market. It's pumping right now, but I believe it's going to pull back. And when it pulls back, it's going to be down for the rest of the year. Uh, and uh, most of your investments will appreciate next year. 2021, 2022 will be a great year to uh, make a lot of profit in the stock market. But now is the time to buy. For those that were able to buy uh, in March and April, most of them are taking profit right now because the stock market is at uh, a very good place right now. You know, everything was green today and I believe it's today, uh, next tomorrow, which is, I don't know, 4.30, it's going to be green as well. So people are going to take profits. People are going to sell. But be very careful and mindful of what's going to happen in the second quarter of 2020 when most companies will be re, you know, reporting their earnings and their earnings are gonna be negative. They're not gonna be good because of you know, the pandemic, what we, you know, we're going through right now. And so there will be opportunities to buy again you know, sometime in June, July. So guys, be very patient, be very careful, you know, learn. Take this moment that we are you know, being at home. Take this moment to learn. Take this moment to you know, you know, research and and reach out to people that know a little bit more and gain some knowledge and take advantage of this. Cash is golden. If you have cash on the side, you know, it will help you in this market right now. Guys, uh, I have another article that I'm going to drop it later on today. Uh, you know, I'm excited for some of these developing countries. You know, originally I'm from Nigeria. Uh, some of these developing countries like uh, Nigeria and some other African countries have potential opportunity to grow. It's uh, There's a reason they call them developing countries because they're still developing. So there will be opportunities there. And they have the population, they have the education, they, they have the resources to grow. So I believe in 2021, 2022, most of these developing countries are gonna go up. So I'm gonna drop another video uh, just to focus on Africa as a whole. So guys, it's a juicy time. It's exciting time. I expect you to take advantage of these fellows. Take advantage of this. 
and I'll be sure to drop you another video tomorrow. Stay blessed, stay juicy, stay spicy. All right, take care. Peace out.